let's get started with the warm up. We're gonna warm up our core and our body a little bit before we start the ab work. Come on to our hands. We're gonna come into an upward facing dog. Good, stretching out the core, squeezing the glutes. If you wanna take it up a notch, you can come with your quads off of the mat. I'm gonna keep mine on. Inhale and exhale. We're gonna push back into downward facing dog. Keeping the core activated, stretching out the whole body. Good, now we're gonna come into plank and we're gonna hold here, isometric hold for 10 seconds. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, good. Pushing back into child's pose, forehead to the ground. Coming back up, going into cat cow. Arching the back, sucking in the belly button to spine, and then coming up. And then arching. And then coming up, really sucking that belly button to spine, arching like a cat. And then coming into cow two more times. Good work. Now we're going to thread the needle, reaching and coming across, looking at the palm. Good, come up and switch. Other side, thread the needle, come down. Feel a deep stretch in the shoulder and the back. Good, come back up to tabletop. We're gonna reach opposite hand and opposite foot and hold for 10. Flexing the foot, reaching long through the fingertips. Last, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one, switch, other side. Reaching long through the flexed foot, through the fingertips, sucking the belly button to spine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. We're gonna inhale, exhale, inhale, reach arching the back exhale inhale reaching exhale bring it down you should feel warm in your body in your core I'm first exercise is a elbow plank with the arm extension this is pretty advanced so you can do it on your knees if it's too hard on your toes come on to your elbows and your toes right here squeeze and suck in the abs and the glutes and then reach reach extend the arm alternating Try to keep the hips stable, the back flat, and the core tight. We're going 50 seconds here. This is a tough one. Get right into it. This is an advanced move. If it's too much, go to your knees. Still keep the abs engaged and keep reaching on your knees. Otherwise, you're on your toes. Reach, go from that elbow. Squeeze and suck in the abs. Squeeze the glutes. And breathe. You're doing great. Last five, four, three, two, one. Whew. Great job. I really felt that one. What you're gonna do is you're gonna lean all the way back, full extension, come up and split. Come all the way down and split. It's a sit up with a split. Reach back, open up, split. Good, you're doing great. Whew. This is like a full sit up with a little extra flexibility thrown in. Good, reach and squeeze. Good, you're almost there. Fully extend back, full sit up and split.
Good, last five, four, three, and one, nice job. So we're gonna go into side to side plank variations. So you'll start in your regular plank here and you'll roll to one side, come down the center, roll to the other side. Again, we're working the full abs here. Come on down to your elbows, reach here, other side. Good, make sure to keep those hips level and off the ground. Suck the belly in and roll it out. Rolling plank. Good, reach. Go at your own pace. This move takes some coordination. Good. Back to the center, really feel it. Center and side. Center, other side. Good, keep it going. I am feeling this in my abs. Last five and four. Three, two, and one. Great job, you did awesome. Good, next thing's called the marching plank. So come on over. You're gonna come onto your hands, all right? Come into plank position. Make sure the legs are close together and you're gonna lift one leg, alternating, lift the other. It's called a marching plank. Suck the belly button to the spine. Keep the glutes engaged. Back flat, core tight, arms straight and locked out, and lift, just march it out. 50 full seconds here. Try to get that leg up high if you can. Breathe through it. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and whew. I really felt that one. That was great, you guys. Here we are going into the next move, which now is double dime bicycle. So it goes pulse, pulse, switch, pulse, pulse, switch. Here we go. Let's do this. One, two, switch. One, two, bring it to center, switch. One, two, switch. One, two, pulsing bicycles. One, two, oh, I'm feeling it, are you? One, two. One, two, back to center. One, two, make sure the belly button's to the spine. One, two. One, two. One, two, almost there. One, two. One, two, keep it up. One, two, switch. One, two, switch. One, two, switch. One, two, switch. Last one. One, two, switch. Nice work. How we doing it? Oh, I'm feeling it. That's only bringing the hands underneath the lower back. We're going out, crunching in. Out and in for 20. Good. So we know that we got to do cardio. That's the way to burn the fat, lose the fat around the abdomen, lose that belly fat. This workout, Ultimate Abs, is what we do to build muscle. Yes, so when we burn the fat with the cardio and we gain the muscle, that's when the six pack is coming through. We see those nice little squares, right? Yes, we do, good. Breathe through it. <sighs> Crunch those at knees all the way in. 10 more. 10, nine, working these lower abs, really feeling it in the hip flexor. Eight, seven, six, good. Five, straight legs, four, three, two, one. Good, next move. Same thing as we just did, instead of the knees crunching in and out, we go up and down, straight leg, reverse lunge, or reverse uh, abs right here. One, going for 20. Two, legs long and straight. Try to touch the ground if you can. Protect the lower back with your hands underneath. Three, belly button to the spine, remember your core. Back flat, 
Try not to have a uh, arch in the lower back. Want to have good form here so we protect the lower back. We build the abdominal muscles to keep a strong back. That's how we do it. That's why your core is your most important muscle because it stabilizes your whole body. It's your center, right? That's why we got to do this ultimate ab workout. If you could do this a few times a week, whoo, you are in good shape, let me tell you, because this is a tough workout. Last eight, good. Seven, breathing. Six, try not to have any tension in the neck. Focusing all your energy, muscle, mind, connection in the abs. Four, breathing. Three, two, one. Good, take a quick break. Release. The next thing is really focused, okay? What you're gonna do is you're gonna just reach, but you have to increase it. You alternate and you squeeze. Again, this is for that muffin top. Those love handles, say goodbye to those. You're gonna get a flat belly fast in only seven minutes. So really reach. If you wanna increase it, add a weight. Do a weighted side to side crunch. Otherwise, here I'm just using my arm weight. I'm squeezing and contracting the abs like there's a pencil on my love handle and I'm squeezing it. Whew. If you really focus and squeeze, believe me, you'll feel it. It looks easy, but sometimes looks are deceptive, right? Good. Lift that elbow high and crunch. Always keep the core engaged, belly button to spine. I'm gonna say that over and over again. Good, last five, squeeze. Four, three, two, one, nice job. It looks simple, but it's not. This is gonna be a torso twist, but go low. So again, horse stance, burn out the legs, keep the elbows at 90 degrees, twist, suck the belly to the spine, really twist that torso. Look side to side. Go at your own pace. Good, ooh, I'm feeling this one. You're doing great. Come on, squeeze. Your last 50 seconds, give it to me here. Twist it out. Side to side, come on, we're almost there. Twist, twist, suck it in. Contract as you twist. Last few here, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice job at home.
We got a two minute cool down here. March it out. You deserve this cool down. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Good. Breathing through the nose, out the mouth. Good. Widen out the stance. Reaching over, switching over. Good. Lengthening through the side body. Core is engaged, arms are straight. Last five. Deep stretch, four, then we hold. Three, two, one, hold. Breathing, get deeper. Try to put your hand down the side of the shin. Breathe, three, two, one, switch. Other side. Reaching, reaching long through the fingertips. Three, two, one, good. Hamstring stretch, flex the foot, hinge at the hip, reach for the toe. Core is tight, always activated, even during stretching. Breathing, three, two, one, switch, other side. Flexing the foot, hinging at the hip, reaching for the toe, flat back. Breathing, don't hold your breath, especially on the cool down. We want all that good oxygen to the brain from our awesome workout. Good. Let's do a few deep breaths. Inhale. Exhale, reach up. Inhale. Exhale, reach long through the fingertips. Last one. Inhale. Exhale. Breathe it all out. Heart center. Thank you. Awesome job. See you next time.